Did you know that knee pain is one of the most common complaints among adults? That's right. This pesky problem is prevalent, affecting a broad spectrum of people. Athletes, for example, frequently face this challenge due to the high-intensity nature of their activities. Older adults, too, often grapple with knee pain as age-related wear and tear takes a toll. So, from the track to the living room, knee pain is a reality for many. It's clear that knee pain is a widespread issue, but what exactly causes it? Knee pain can stem from several sources, some more common than others. One of the most frequent causes is injury. In fact, damage to any part of your knee, from ligaments to tendons, can lead to discomfort and pain. Common injuries include sprains, strains, and tears, often resulting from athletic activities or accidents. Arthritis is another common cause of knee pain. There are over 100 types of arthritis, but osteoarthritis, rheumatoid arthritis, and gout are the types most likely to affect the knee. Overuse injuries, such as runner's knee or jumper's knee, are also frequent culprits. These conditions occur when repetitive motions or excessive strain lead to wear and tear on the knee. Moving on to less common causes, certain infections or diseases like Lyme disease can also result in knee pain. While these are not as prevalent, they're still important to consider when diagnosing knee conditions. Now that we understand the likely culprits behind knee pain, how do we diagnose it? Diagnosing knee pain usually involves a physical examination and possibly some additional tests. Your healthcare provider may start by asking about your symptoms and medical history, then move on to a physical examination, looking for any visible signs of injury or inflammation. Depending on your symptoms, imaging tests like X-rays or MRIs might be necessary. Lab tests can also be used to rule out infection or other conditions. So, we've identified the cause of our knee pain. What's the next step? The treatment of knee pain largely depends on the underlying cause. Conventional methods often involve medication and physical therapy, while alternative treatments might include acupuncture or massage therapy. But managing knee pain isn't just about treatment, it's also about making lifestyle adjustments. Simple behavior changes like taking regular breaks from sitting and practicing good posture can make a significant difference. Regular gentle exercises can also help to strengthen the knee and improve flexibility. In terms of prevention, maintaining a healthy weight is key. Excess weight puts additional stress on your knees, so keeping in check can help to prevent knee pain. A balanced diet, rich in anti-inflammatory foods, can also play a role in keeping your knees healthy. And of course, regular exercise is crucial. But remember, it's about consistency, not intensity. Low-impact exercises like swimming or cycling can be particularly beneficial. Remember, while knee pain is common, it's not insurmountable. With the right knowledge and approach, you can manage and even prevent it.